In which religion, in which society, in which culture, in which civilization does it command the man to give a bridal gift to the woman and she has a right to do whatever you know, she pleases with it in the halal of course and the husband hasn't got the right to take it or ask for it and it's a debt upon his neck no matter what happens and that if she dies and he doesn't pay it he must give it to her heirs her father her mother her brothers her sisters they're her, the ones who will inherit her who has that right except in Islam which one commands the man to work but doesn't command the woman to work and if she wants to she can with her husband's permission and if she does her money is hers is hers she is not obliged to pay it which religion tells you that if the man divorces his wife for the next three menstrual periods he must provide her with shelter and wealth and that for the rest of his life he has to look after the children not her even if they live with her which religion says that except for Islam which religion tells you that if your enemy that is fighting and holds a sword against you or is shooting at you comes to you and says to you please let me give me shelter at your home comes out of the army comes to you after he had shot many of your friends and your brothers and sisters in Islam and says to you give me shelter in your home and commands the Muslim to give him shelter this is in the Quran and if any of the disbelievers who are fighting you asked you to give them shelter, you must give them shelter. Which one says that? And then when they go back home, they become normal fighters to you as they were before. The same fighter. Which one says that? Which cultural civilization gives us the na'mah, the blessings of a daughter? When in many Arab cultures, for example, even in many other cultures, even till today, when you have a girl, everybody's quiet. We have that saying in Lebanese. When everybody's quiet in a room, you say, A girl is born. When a boy is born, everybody rejoices. Which one brings the ni'mah and says, For any man or parent, sorry, any man or who has three daughters who they raise on righteousness, there will be a guard for them from hellfire on the day of judgment. Even one daughter did not mention the boy, not the boy, just the girl, only the girl.